has Nigerians ever asked how exactly Aboki FX collects his data that he publishes on his website? How many BDCs can claim that they have either seen a staff of Aboki FX coming to ask for daily rates? Or how many BDCs send daily returns on exchange rate to Aboki FX? How then do they determine what the rate is and they post them illegally on their website? In which other country will an unlicensed single person be the one that sets exchange rate in that country? How come he sets exchange rate of our own currency? Why is he not setting exchange rate of pounds, to do pounds and dollar? Or pounds and South African rand? Or pounds and Ghana CD? Why target Nigeria? And yet, you are a Nigerian. You choose to live in London, enjoy all the, all the spoils in London at the expense of the blood of Nigerians. You will pay for it. The CBN Act Section 2 does make it clear that only the central bank can determine the value of the Naira. And yet, a single unscrupulous individual who lives in London continues to manipulate the rate of the Nigerian or rate of X rate of for Nigerians, continues to make huge profits, continues to collect these profits in cash ATM in London, while other Nigerians suffer the consequences of these actions. We will not allow this to continue again. What kind of registration does he have that allows him to do the kind of business he's doing? People should tell me. How exactly does he collect this data? Do you know any BDC that supplies this data? He should come out and give us this information. If he doesn't come out, we will find him. I have given instruction to our experts to go after his website. And let it be clear, we will go after him because we cannot allow this to continue. Since the inception of this company in 2015, he has, he, he has kept, he kept filing the same cash at hand and net assets and shareholders' funds. You may go ahead and check his UK filings. Yet millions of Naira and thousands of dollars go through his account. So that is the story of Aboki FX. And I hear that he's making news in social media. I'm not on social media. But let him come and meet me in Central Bank. Let him show his face. Those who feel they want to support him to fight me, come out. Let's fight.